if I believe that I'm very good at the game, I should maybe transform. Maybe I should. Fuck. Does being better at the game make you want to transform because you can adjust to whatever cards you get? Or make you not want to transform because you don't need a high variance option on floor zero? What's the answer? It's a really good act for transform because there's a lot of upside. Huh. Feels like the situation where there's upside. I'm hoping this doesn't attack me next turn. So I can kill this. If it does attack me... I think I have to take two. Should we skip straight to silent? Uh, probably not. Remembering spot weakness, and then we can just miss spot weakness and die. Kind of appealing. Spot weakness does not work against slime boss. Um, an iron wipe is fine. Those much lower variants. Three gem pots, good headbutt. I like headbutt here with spot weakness. Havoc? No Brimstone, no Toxic Egg. If you have beaten the heart with a character, you get a thing that lets you toggle on beta art for the character's cards. Whichever ones you'd like. That is an early rare. Also, I'll take a... But what if I didn't have any cards in my deck? Would that make the sentries easier to kill? Two rares on floor five. True. Was there a barricade run yesterday? Yep. Or zero pocket watch. Let me take a barricade at the end of Act 1. Which was kind of fun. There are a lot of dazes in my deck and not a lot of cards. It's almost like I played Fiendfire removing them all. Might be on me. Is 
Maybe the opposite of yesterday's ironclad run where nothing seemed to go right at the start. Yesterday's ironclad run started with fuck I watch from the whale. Oh, I played two ironclad runs yesterday. The first ironclad run yesterday was not great. The second one was. I had forgotten about that. I haven't gotten no idea. I could skip these, maybe. I could also take and upgrade Flame Barrier and be pretty happy. So much gold all of a sudden. My deck doesn't really beat Slime Balls. I might have to go this way with all the gold. Watch the best way I'll relic. And this is Dead Branch. Fuck, watch is real, real good. Real, real good. This sets me up all frack 2 already. Hmm. Cleat doesn't work against Slime Boss either. I have so much stuff and none of it actually kills Slime Boss. It's like such a waste of the act to go this way. I could get the Super Elite. But I do have to beat Slime Boss to win the run. Ow. about it, looter. Don't even think about it. Almost try. Did a bunch of people tell you you were really lucky, Aether? Thirteen plus thirteen is twenty-six. This is also twenty-six. That kinda is rude. a little bit rude. Okay, Anger beats Slime Boss. I think so. Bag? And? Some good stuff. I'm intrigued by finesse. I'm intrigued by clockwork souvenir. I already have an artifact charge though. I'm intrigued by disarm. I'm intrigued by dark embrace. Shockwave. Like everything. Just everything. What a shop. I don't think I can spend 95 on finesse. Always this. Maybe just always clockwork souvenir. Could be dark embrace disarm card remove. Disarm's kind of good. Not the best against slime boss, but dark embrace should be good against slime boss.
Dark Embrace with Fiend Fire just seems very reasonable. Criminal how I ignore the shopkeeper's dialogue. It's criminal how the shopkeeper's dialogue keeps like showing up over the things that I'm trying to choose between. That's what's criminal. I'm playing Ironclad. I don't think card removes that good. Disarm plus card remove or clockwork souvenir, no card remove. Clockwork Souvenir is so good. This arm's also pretty good. I already have Flame Barrier for multi tech fights. Do this. Do this. Feels like it's lethal. Any battle trances? I'd love a battle trance. The boot! Battle transon? I believe battle transon. I wouldn't hate Snekoi. If I do take Snekoi, it's kind of weird to upgrade Anger. But I'd be very happy to have a Snekoi right now. Makes me not want to upgrade this or this, which like otherwise those would be upgrades that I did want. Weird choice. I'll have to at high health to get our Dark Embrace on play. I don't know. We'll see. spot weakness hit. I miss again next turn. Thirty seven is the split. Fight. 
saving this, just like have a clockwork souvenir. It's a lot of work for not much benefit. But I can, so I will. Corruptino. Oh. Those aren't very good. Do I want to curse on the relics now, or the relics later with no curse? I'll go relics later with no curse. Chosen was common for me. Warcry plus over second Dark Embrace. I can't play Dark Embrace, it costs too much. The boot! Upgraded of zero energy. I have corruption, dark embrace. Ugh. Should take it. Oh, I should take it. Alright. Mummified hand. That would have been good. Card removes very powerful right now. And that pain toolbox also seems very good. I don't know how you pick between those two, because they're both... I mean, I get card remove Feel No Pain, right? We always buy Feel No Pain, that's just... that's always happening. I don't know how you pick between Toolbox and card remove here. Probably you just take Toolbox, probably that's how. That's probably the answer. Serious Goblin! me maybe reaper is moderately interesting there i think reapers have a right there i 
that shouldn't take enough damage. It's a good body slam plus so far. I don't know that Evolve Plus is doing much. Shrug Plus draws corruption in ways where I can't play it, which is kind of bad. I really need to upgrade corruption, I think. Really need to upgrade corruption, Dark Embrace. But I don't think I can do this, even though it's tons of relics. And I probably survive it, I just think. Like, sometimes I don't survive it because I, like, almost strike into corruption and can't play it, and then I just die. So going here, upgrading Corruption, here for Dark Embrace, gets one Elite out of the act. I should beat Collector easily. And potions aren't that great either. I have no AoE really. That makes it easier to play um, Corruption and Dark Embrace. Also makes Fiendfire a lot better. Was that a good floor? Yeah, that was a good floor. It's actually incorrect. That was incorrect. Iron Clat. I wasn't even thinking about the fact that Dark Shackles exhausted. Because it's not on my deck, so it's like not a card that I'm thinking about. I don't want to draw a card because I don't want to draw Corruption when I can't play it right now. Yeah! I think the Body Slam there is crucial. I think this is lethal. I don't think I care about Feel No Pain. That's why we took Body Slam. Bronze Scales, Strike Dummy, Energy Pot's nice. Exhum? This should be an Exhum. Exhum over Feel No Pain. Feel No Pain's good. I'm pretty sure it's still Exhum though. Feel No Pain is really good. VOD channel for non Slay the Spire is not a secret. But it's not really like promoting shit. It's a lot of work. Why is that the one I put on top? Questionable. The boot! 
Seeing red? Seeing red? Kinda legit. I even play the bomb. I was very excited about it, and like, is it even good? Oh, well, now it is. Double bomb would have been fun. I don't think it was right. But it would have been fun. Maybe that's more important. Also... See if I can just kill them without it anyway. Alright, we're gonna let the bomb have its fun. Way to go, the bomb. Oh. I agree, Furio. I didn't read what you wrote, though. My turn ones are kind of good. Other path I took ended up being really good. What? 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 Who? What? That I kind of wanted the path with more loot 10 minutes ago. Oh. How do you know if I was good or not? Boom. He might have killed me. That wouldn't be good. Nobody likes to see me die. That's not true. A lot of you are here. How many of you here just hoping for me to die? Like in the game, not IRL. That was grim for a second. Me, 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 hi, me. Oh my god, Tweegee. Oh my god, Tweegee. <laughs>
You like it when Jorbs does well. That's very counterculture. There are a weird amount of people who say mean shit to YouTube Jorbs who probably revel in my defeats. I know, right? I haven't read YouTube comments for a long time. Why are people just like this? Why? You just not do that? Most YouTube comments are kind. True. Some of them are bizarrely not. This lecture is so much fun. That's Slay the Spire, as Richard Garfield intended. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think I did Juggernaut here. Very possible that it's the worst of the three. But I'm still into it. It does a lot of damage. Feels like a really easy runic pyramid. Power through. Uh, we want as many elites as possible. I can get three this way with no campfires, basically, in the storm. Or I can get three this way, and it's like a lot safer. I can heal a bit more easily. I guess this heals me 15 with meal ticket. I have a lot of impervious. I'm probably fine. You heard that three energy is impossible on the ironclad character. Have you been, like, reading things people think about Slay the Spire again, Merle? You gotta stop that. That's not a good idea. It is kind of awkward that um, I'm like blocking myself from drawing my powers. <laughs> Was there any pyramid? I'm still relatively happy to have it. But it's not completely non-problematic. In fact, a second corruption would be really good here. Seeing red plus feels like the card for the job. You vastly underestimate toolbox. Toolbox is like. If it's worse than bag of prep, it's not by much most of the time. Like, it's very good. It's a very, very good relic. Definitely some deck. Some decks like it more than others, but. Yeah, it's good.
Another shrug? How much fuel do I have for my powers? Not that much. Too impervious. I'm just fine though. I guess I have an offering, so it's hard to take. Um, can no longer heal, unfortunately. Also hard to take normalities. Could have played blind that time. Gotta chill out. It's gonna be such a big body slam when I get to play it, which is totally going to happen. Alright, goodbye Hexagust. This is good. This is good. John! Two in a row? Are you kidding me? Blessed. drivers. I've been Ubering around the city like a little bit recently. I definitely don't love doing it, but I also don't drive, so yeah. And I moved them um, a bit further away from public transit than I was before. It's incredible how much entertaining Uber drivers do. I don't have to, right? You could just not talk. Driving in Seattle sucks. I just don't like driving in general. I was in a car crash um, around about the time that all my friends were learning to drive, and I was like, I'm good. <laughs> and I just never found a need to learn to drive after that. Yeah, I also think cars kind of suck, so the fact that I can live a life without using one is, you know, something I'm very happy about. Part of iron over deck spots kind of weird. It does make Juggernaut deal more damage, though. Never bike. Yep, I have two bikes. I used to bike a lot more in LA. The weather's not as good for it in Seattle, but not terrible either. I've always done fine with hells. Cycling has never been an issue for me. I used to go up and down the Santa Monica Mountains like four times a day in LA. I love that shit. I 
Taking Elias sounds like a death wish. I mean, it's just cycling in general. But also, uh, like, do you know what happens if you drive? Like, the way that we do transit in the US is just very, very dangerous for everybody involved. Unfortunately. Another bottle. Dropkick's like kinda cute, but I don't think I ever need it. I already got Mind Blooms, so I should probably do a Holly fight. Maybe I do want Dropkick. What if I do? No, I have tons of damage, right? Moving in general is quite troublesome. Yep. Terrifying stuff. I love that my artifact charge is regularly blocking battle trance, and also it's good. <laughs> a little weird. Usually when that happens I feel like it's bad, but it has been quite good this round. The boot, the boot. Alien in particular is not a friendly place for bikes as far as roads go. Uh, Alien has some really nice bike lanes, actually. And the weather is really good, so you don't have huge issues with like roads being slick very often. And the um, Santa Monica Beach has an incredible bike trail that runs like 50 or 60 miles if you want to get up and down the coast. Colorful pocket sinks at 25 months. I don't know actually how far it runs. Maybe it's not that far. Maybe it's only like 30. I don't know. I used to do that bike trail a lot for exercise, though. Actually, all of my bike crashes in LA were pedestrians being idiots on that bike path, <laughs> rather than um, cars. So, I don't know what the takeaway is. Instantly grants you 20 IQ. That's the answer. Okay. Sure, I'll take another feel no pain. Why not? Why shouldn't I have a feel no pain? Shockwave's not bad. Orange palettes seems excellent. Harder move seems excellent. I don't know if I want the shockwave or not. I could also just take Ornithopter, which seems very good. Or I could just like go next. I'm pretty safe. I think I'm pretty safe. Not three cats in a trench coat, thanks for the six months! It. The best part of Toolbox is the fact that it pays for itself with Hand of Greed over the course of the run. Jump rings to the prime. It doesn't actually pay for itself. It would be cool. It would be cool. I wonder how close people have gotten to having Toolbox just straight up pay for itself. I have not personally done that. I think I have Lethal. Like, I'm sitting there like, I should end turn, and then I'm like, wait, I have lethal. Because sweet. I 
Have they thought of putting airbags in planes? That is... Wait, I forgot the hand of Rude. It's okay. I'm gonna note that as a mistake, but also this run is over, so I'm not gonna beat myself up about it. The seed ends in fool, it does. It does end in fool. You are right. Power, skill, attack. Power, skill, skill, attack. Gotta get the upgraded one. Berry in a bottle, sure. Just needs to make organ donation opt out, not opt in. I think that's one of the less controversial arguments for taking away individual something or other. I don't know, what is that exactly? You're arguing for the government to, by default, take people's organs. It does sound like kind of messed up, <laughs> but yeah. Arguing for the government to, by default, take people's organs. Gosh, gosh, there have been some iterations of the US government that would have done very, 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 very nasty things with that um, default. I wonder... <laughs> If this is one of them. You still have the individual liberty to say no. I mean, maybe. Lifeless bodies aren't people though. Yeah, but they used to be. You can turn a person into a lifeless body. So if you need organs and there are people you don't value very much, and by default, if you turn a person into a lifeless body, you get organs. You've just, like, created an argument from utilitarian ethics for murder. Murder is still illegal? Oh yeah, absolutely. And the US government has cared a lot about that over the uh, course of history. Gosh. US government would never do anything that would harm someone. It's not murder, it's organ harvesting. That's that's a good point. Very different. <laughs> Think of the jobs it will create. Now there's an angle. <laughs> I mean, that's an angle right there. Now you're speaking my language. Done. 
Trolley is going to run over five people tied to track or run over one person, but they're an organ donor. Wait, no, it's the other way. No, no, no. A conundrum's the other way. A trolley is going to run over one person on a track or five people, and they are organ donors. Waken one is kind of the highest health enemy in the game. Kind of. how you count the regen. Also the adds, I guess. Why? Why, why would I do that? What? You can just root the trolley to the least amount of harm possible. Mm, well, the trolley problem initially is about agency. If you choose to take someone's life because you deem it to be less harm than somebody else dying. Is that an okay thing to do? But then also there are a bunch of trolley problems where it's unclear where the least harm is, which, you know. I don't think I've used pink fire a single time. I used it a decent chunk in Act 1 and 2. But yeah, a lot of the cards on my hand are really good, so... It has been less frequently used since then. Does the Tesla automated driver kill the baby or not? The Teslas can't see babies. Like, they don't. If the child is within a mile of a Tesla, it is invisible to the Tesla. is known. Child invincibility is part of the utilitarian ethics patch Tesla's got last update. That's good. That's good. I'm glad somebody is doing something about that. When you're on your bike by Tesla's, you can see the giant screen through the window. You've never once shown up on the object detection view when it's up. That's encouraging, right? I feel like that's encouraging. I personally love the idea that I'm completely invisible. Like a superpower. Purity isn't that bad. Maybe I'll just take purity. Take another feel not pain too, why not? Be bashes made obsolete by thunderclap in the stuck. 
possible. Why is no one on the camera but you hear a voice? Wait, you can hear me? Oh. Because I still need that patch. Thank you, Kaka. for the kill? I think zoomed Apotheosis, that would have been cooler. Embraces. Just need to get old coin to the right number. Really appreciate this deck being incredibly easy to play. It's very kind of it. Thirty for fifty damage. Sixty damage. Sixty damage. Wall. Mistake didn't pick the bomb. Actually deliberate, believe it or not. Attack. Power. Skill. Have corruption in my hand. GG. Go next turn though. Go next turn. A deliberate mistake is still a mistake. Hmm. Fair enough. What do I think about helicopters? You know, I don't think about helicopters often. Maybe that's one of my weaknesses as a person. My greatest personal failing? Possibly. Aries. I love the idea of whatever you just read. I 
it's a good copy pasta. Oh, okay. I believe you. I don't even need to play Body Slam. Oh, that down. Oh, hey, Holy Strike. Thank you. Why did the other tier runs today have to be so hard? It's unfair. I want to play more Slay the Spire, but I have to go to Portland now. This is the worst. Why did I win that run? Like, what happened? I don't even... I transformed at the spot weakness impervious. And then I got Agate Drop. Slime boss fight was really close, wasn't it? And then I ended